Hello and welcome to our recent additions video. This is a video showing you uh, what I have recently acquired. Let's start with this. This is a piece of advertising for Yoshi's Woolly World uh, which came out here in Europe on the 26th of June. I thought this would make a uh, this would make a very nice backdrop for my Amiibo shelf where I've got my Amiibos lined up in front of it. Absolutely beautiful uh, depiction of some some of the variations of Yoshi you can acquire within the game. You can of course put your amiibo on the pad and it unlocks even more um, skins which is absolutely fantastic. Up next we've got Angry Birds Star Wars Telepods. Now these are the toys to life versions of Angry Birds. Basically what you do is you put this little pod on your phone or tablet uh, on the, the camera lens and I don't know if you can see that, but there's a little square there with a little uh, code on there, which the camera then reads through this. For some reason, it needs this. Um, and you get to play as one of these characters, Yoda or Emperor, or any others which uh, you can come across. Handily doesn't show on here, although it's got loads of different. Mess in Grand. Beautiful. I'm not sure how successful they were actually as um, I don't really see them anymore and that was very very cheap um, so there we are we've got as you can see a stack of games to get through um, by a stack I mean a few Star Wars Star Wars Doi Star Fox Adventures um, made by Rare one of the last console Rare games uh, for a Nintendo system um, a very good game just felt like replaying it again, and I didn't have it, so now I do. Dino Crisis 3, didn't play it when it first came out. I don't know why, as I like dinosaurs, and I like Resident Evil. Um, I know a lot of people are calling for a new one, so hopefully I can play this and go, yes, I also want a new one. Brute Force, now for some reason, I played the demo uh, on the original Xbox, really, really enjoyed it didn't pick up the game for some reason, I don't know why. I would imagine there might have been another game coming out at the same time, which prevented me from buying it. Um, they haven't really looked at doing any more of them, so I would imagine it didn't sell very well for some reason, but it's a very good game. Now, as you can see here, we've got Alien Isolation, and it's the lifeboat, uh, kind of like replica almost, a steelbook version, which I believe um, is Amazon exclusive, or was Amazon exclusive. You have to correct me if I'm wrong on that one. But this was uh, second hand, and it's absolutely pristine. Um, I had to have this. I have a small uh, collection of about 20 or so steelbooks starting, um, and I had to add that one um, to the collection as I hadn't actually seen it before, so there we are. Legend of K Anniversary. Uh, didn't play it on the PS2 where where it first launched. Hearing good things about it. I'm enjoying my first hour or so of it so far, so a good game. Another good game, God of War 3 Remastered. Again, I've missed out on this game when it first came around, but now I get to play it all in glorious HD, even more HD, I suppose, than it were. Uh, Bayonetta 2. Now, I already do own this game in the form of, uh, where is it, the uh, first print edition, but I'm keeping that uh, sealed, so I thought it was about time I played the game, as I've just uh, made my way through the first one, so now I'm more fresh for the story. going to play this one, looking forward to it. Another game I'm looking forward to playing is Scribblenauts Unlimited. Never played one of these games. Uh, this one got delayed in Europe, so it was kind of forgotten about, I assume, and that's why it's, it can be quite expensive, but I found this for 15 quid, uh, which is about $20, I suppose, um, which I thought was an absolute bargain. Uh, we've got Mario, there's also Link and Zelda and all manner of other Nintendo characters in this game. Hopefully a very, very good platformer. Uh, for my last item, I have... Silver Mario Amiibo. Uh, he is going to stay in this box, unfortunately, um, until I get hold of a uh, European version, because um, 
this is an American one and they haven't released them over here in Europe yet but they will hopefully um, so then I will get another one and then I will unbox one of them um, I'm also on the hunt for a gold one but at a reasonable price I might have to wait out until they release them officially over here though um, it is absolutely beautiful based off the um, Super Mario style ones which as you saw there came out with Mario Party 10 and yeah there we are that is my collection recent editions um, some good games that I'm looking forward to playing like Scribblenauts and yeah let me know what you think um, I hope you enjoyed it also check out my other collections videos as well so I've got uh, I'll put like a little link or something to my Zelda collection video and also uh, I've got a small sampling of um, Club Nintendo items which I'll link there as well so make sure you check them out and let me know what you think cheers